What is up guys, welcome back to some more Pokemon Shield Nuzlocke. I almost messed up that intro actually, and we're going to start it off with some evolutions. Um, I got enough points, uh, den points, to use the digging duo brothers, and uh, I finally, after like, I want to say like 10 attempts, got a water stone. So I wanted to use that water stone to evolve Shimmy Sham into its Ludicolo form because things are about to get real now, at least in my opinion. And other than that evolution, as you guys can see by the overlay as well, um, I'm evolving uh, Neo as well. Uh, I think we just need more, more oomph on the team, and putting these two at their final form will definitely help out a lot until we get teardrops, checkmate, and start packs to their final form as well. So I hope everybody's having a a good day it's a friday for me um oh yeah extreme speed totally forgot that evolving growlith will teach you that um honestly i don't think i need flame wheel like that but also after even evolving these guys um we're in a new area so being that we're in a new area that means we can catch new pokemon and I think I'll start off with uh, Teardrops, just because Teardrops has Swift, which is pretty well. So just to prove to you guys that we're in a new area, this is Bridgefield, I think. I think that's what it's called. We just came from, from the bridge underpass. Yeah, Motostoke Riverbank is where we came from, and then now we're at Bridgefield. So we can catch a new Pokemon. Um, this is actually probably going to be the episode where we catch a lot of new Pokemon in general. Because there's like five... Ah, uh, evil. I don't think I have Nicky, do I? Yeah, I don't... I don't think I do. So I guess... I guess we already know we're going to name Thievil Swiper. <laughs> Ah, you're also a female, too. Oh, good thing you avoided that. That was clutch. I also leveled up the team a bit um, by doing those dents and getting the, uh, the, ex the little candies. Whatever they were called. Um, so I got everybody up to at least minimum 30. I felt like that was a good level to get everybody else to. Um, we are going to nickname you Swiper. I don't know why it comes off as like Swipper to me. I feel like I should put two P's. Swiper. Swipper. Now it looks even more like Swipper. Uh... <laughs> Okay, there we go. We're gonna send you to the box. Um, and that actually reminds me, there is more nicknames that I'm going to be using. Uh, I just have to look back at the, the comment <laughs> that, uh, that was put with the three names. So now we're in another new area so we can catch stuff um i guess it's really up to me trying to figure out which which grass patch i want to go into but i guess it really doesn't matter this one's just more dangerous those zigzagoons yo i did not know we could get an impidimp out here Uh, wow. I didn't know you could get impotent this early. I thought we could only get it later on. That's actually good to know. But dang, now it's like, what do I... I don't know, because he becomes Grimmsnarl, and I kind of want to call him, like, Snarlfang or something. <laughs> I 
I don't know. I think I think that'd be a good name to use. Yeah, Snarlfang. And I'm not I'm not gonna add him to the team yet. Um, I think if I end up losing Checkmate, I'll add Snarlfang just to bring uh, Dark Type back onto the team. And I used. Uh, a Grim Snarl on like my regular playthrough as well, so I kind of again don't want to use a lot of the same Pokemon from before. Yep, now we're at the Dusty Bowls, so uh, this should be like a ground type Pokemon that we get here. Um, I'll honestly say if if it's hip, if it's a Hippowdon or wow. A very strong okay we can't catch this I don't even think I can I don't think I have pokey dolls for this uh, nope we are s o l so we're gonna have to come back here actually um yeah, I don't think I can run. Oh, I can run. Woo. Safe. Okay, guys, so we're not going to have that count as our encounter. That was way too strong. Uh, there was no way we were going to be able to capture that or even defeat it, I think. So just know, Dusty Ball, we have to come back to. Oh, uh, but now we're at Giant's Mirror. So Giant's Mirror counts. Also, let me heal up just in case, because I kind of got freaked out when I saw that. Oh, it's a very strong Pokemon. I was like, oh, snap, we might lose teardrops. Oh, no, that don't that doesn't even count, because you ran towards me, bro. Everything's just high leveled out here. What the heck? Oh, that was my chance. We're just gonna check, just to be sure. Okay, we already have um, a Shellos, right? Yeah, we already have you, so we can't catch you. But okay, note to self, we will just avoid all these over... Overland Pokemon? Oh, it's a Vulp... Is that a Vulpix? I think that was a Vulpix I saw. Oh wow, we got a Skorupi. That works out. Um, is Skorupi Poison Dark or Poison Bug? I don't know, either way I like the design for Drapion. So, you can definitely get added to the team later on in the future too. Wow, that that didn't catch you? Wow, come on. Oh, you got a crit on that. Oh, no, no, no. See, what we're going to do is uh, swap you out with Neo. And try to attach you again. Dang, you just really don't want to get caught. Just trying to... Actually, what am I doing? I have a netball. So I believe you have a bug typing in you. Yep, there we go. And luckily I found uh, the nickname that one of the fans slash subscribers wanted. Um, he 
gave three names and we already used Nikki, so I'll just go down the list and you can be Emil, 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 or, uh, yeah, we'll just go with that. I low-key want to swap out like Sir Pex for, uh, Sir Pex for the Skorupi just because I want to. I want to use a Drapion on the team. But alright, out of Giant's Mirror, back in the Dusty Bowl wild area. But we don't care about that because we're moving out of that into the Hammerlock Kills, yep. And now we can catch, again, another Pokemon. <laughs> and you guys are probably like, wow, this is a lot in like one, one episode for just catching, but... Uh, you know, it, it is what it is, guys. I'm trying to catch them at least at an appropriate level with my team. Because it kind of sucked. Um, when I went back after beating the third gym to go to the area, I thought it was stronger in the original wild area. And seeing that it was like level 11, level 14 Pokemon. I'm hoping Water Pulse doesn't take out Esper. Oh no, you actually didn't do that much damage. One more water pulse should do it. Kind of late on the light screen, buddy. All right, sweet. <laughs> I was kind of worried about that one too. I was like, man, this Esper is probably about to break out. Oh, look at that checkmate's level thirty-two. Alrighty, and we're gonna nickname you, uh, Hedek, Herek, Herek. Oh man, I'm like butchering these names that were suggested. <laughs> Don't be mad at me. But okay, I think we're done with our catching frenzy, at least, um, until we can go back to the Dusty Bowl and catch something. There's Giant's Cap, and then Lake of Outrage, you have to have your bike equipped with um, the water stuff. The water floaties on your bike. Yes, check my badges, bro. I got them. They're all here. Oh, what's good, Brody? Yeah, you, you beat Hop. It was humiliating. Hop's now in a bad mood. If there's any more names you guys want to suggest for the Pokemon to be caught in the future, just put it down in the comments section. It'll definitely make it easier for me to nickname these Pokemon. <laughs> and I've realized that I don't think this, uh, the Saladite that I caught, or Slandite that I caught, I don't think it's nickname even registered. So, let me... Let me see. Uh, where is it? Yeah, it didn't even register. I think I said Bougie Queen. I don't know why it didn't take it. Oops. Y'all about to be like, oh man, this, this guy can't spell. Now nah, we're good with that. Our team looks decently ferocious. One of these days I might actually end up going to catch that, uh, 
catching that slow poke just so she stops giving me that notification. And I need a good amount of these just in case. I was caught slacking out there. Oh man, sorry for that noise guys, I, I live near an airport, so you're going to be hearing aircrafts flying over, and my mic is really going to be picking that up too, as well as my clicks, I don't, I try to lower the mic down so it wouldn't pick up the clicks, but if I lower it too low, it's, it's not going to pick up my voice that well. And I think already, like right now, I have the mic away from me, so I don't know how loud I am or how muffled I sound, since I also got a pop filter for my mic. But I hope you guys can hear me clearly enough. What I should have done was talk to that guy that um, I just used to rename nickname a Pokemon. I should have checked to see what new moves I could put on Shimmy Sham or Neo. But I also think like once they hit a certain level as well that um, they'll also be able to le learn like the moves they would have been able to learn before I evolved them. Because I think I really wanted to get Giga Drain on Shimmy Sham. Because right now I just have Mega Drain. I don't, I don't think I can teach Magical Leaf. Um, yeah, no, I can't teach Magical Leaf at all. Oh, you can learn Poison Jab. That's pretty good to know. Oh, but you can learn Seed Bomb. Oh, that's perfect. Oh, it's a TR. Uh, I didn't even, like, check to see if it was better for you to know a physical move or not. No, better for you to do special attacks. So we won't waste Seed Bomb on you. Maybe if I get like a different grass type later on that flourishes with physical moves, uh, we'll just end up teaching that Pokemon Seed Bomb if it's able to learn it even at all. Ah, uh, Raihan. Or not Raihan. Uh, Leon. <laughs> it's been a minute. Yeah, he got his butt whooped, bro. Or bro, that's not my bro, but I can call you bro still. Because you're my rival's bro. Bro. I would go in that cafe and fight, but I'm afraid I'll get my butt whooped. It's too early for a wipe. <laughs> oh, I thought she was trying to stop me from progressing the story. I was like, whoa, what, what you doing there? Oh, this actually works out too, because I believe you can get a Togepi from that chick right there, if you have a Toxel. Uh, that Muscle Band might be really nice to put on Checkmate. I got Leftovers um, at the end of the last episode. I actually just like was exploring when I was going to collect all those points. I found the Leftovers, so... Uh, now I'm trying to decide who to give the leftovers to. It might, it, it might just be best to give it to Neo, but I want to make more money so I can swag my character out. Thank you, bro. I totally wanted your lead card. I 
I was like debating to myself too if I was gonna get the DLC expansion and play through with it because um, right now I'm breeding or trying to breed shinies and stuff and level them up competitively. Oh man, I had to sneeze there, guys. Um, but I'm wondering if I want to do it with shield or do I want to do it with sword? Because I, ha I have both playthroughs um, leveled up, but I have two shinies, I think, on shield, on my regular shield playthrough. So I might use shield for that as well. If you guys are interested in seeing that, I'll upload it on here regardless. <laughs> and we'll just check it out by the views um, on how you guys are responding to that. But I hope you guys end up wanting to watch it i'm still on the fence on if i want to get pokemon mystery dungeon um dx the remaster version of pokemon mystery dungeon just because i don't know how you guys will respond to that video but it looks like you guys are liking the pokemon videos a lot especially since i don't have digimon content to put out there and most of my subscribers um i got when i was recording digimon back in the days when i was in my college dorm and it was like the worst recording ever i was i didn't even have like a separate mic to use i didn't have my own setup i was literally like at my desk that i normally do homework at with my playstation and my playstation headset trying to record i couldn't have i couldn't like basically control any outside noise like my other roommates and such why are you waving um uh, I think he just taught a move, but was there an item down here? No, he just taught you moves, like duo moves or something. Uh, ba -ba -ba. I wish Shimmy Sham could learn bug moves. That would have been clutch to, to have on Shimmy Sham, at least for going up against like these dark type Pokemon. Because I believe we're about to have an encounter with Team Yell. Oh, but actually, no. Teardrops knows U-Turn, so that's clutch. I could put U-Turn and then switch out into Checkmate. Um, I didn't really even check what moves Checkmate had like that, I think. I think I leveled it up, and it learned Assurance, and I haven't really paid attention to the rest of the moves, but I do need to put Poison Jab on Checkmate, because that's also going to be clutch to not have, just in case we go up against something that uh, is super effective. Are weak really weak to poison too as well as like darker steel so we can kind of just have a nice little array of move sets there all right guys do your thing poison dark so I don't even think your turn is going to be super effective against you like that but I'm glad I leveled up the team uh, to a decent level because it looks like team yell is definitely keeping up a new level like that even though they have like two Pokemon it's, it's still to me like the thought that counts <laughs> numbers don't lie Shimmy Sham with the level up, and we got a Linoon coming out, and... Uh, oh, you know Fury Cutter. That's actually nice. I don't think Linoon knows anything that could take out Checkmate. And then Fury Cutter gets stronger, like, the more it, it hits, I believe. Oh my god, you would miss. <laughs> that did a lot more than what it should have did. <laughs> okay, yeah, good. Waste your turn with that Home Claws thing. This is actually the first time I've battled with Checkmate now that I think about it. So it's actually going pretty well. I can't wait to evolve you into uh, Bisharp. 
I said by shark before, but then I was thinking like it's a pun with chess, so pawns and bishops, so pawnier bisharp. <laughs> Uh, totally forgot I had another fight. <laughs> oh yeah, we're definitely gonna U-turn this up. Oh wow, you know Fury Swipe? And... I think I want to switch. I want to switch it to Shimmy Sham just because we don't use Shimmy Sham enough. As much as I hate Shimmy Sham, it's like the the necessary evil. I probably should have checked out and used Nature Power just to see what move we got with that. Clutch, clutch, got the dub. Y'all really worried about this Pokemon sleeping. Now you wake up and want to go. It's fine with me. Get out of my face, bro. What's up, Opal? She's so creepy. I'll keep an eye on you, child. But now we're at a new route, which means a new Pokemon to catch. Um, well, I would love to do that, but I guess we have this battle to do first. <laughs> so I think I'll try to do this battle fast and then end it off with us catching a new Pokemon to add to the box. <laughs> oh, a Clefairy. Hmm... I'm glad we're both, uh... Girl Pokemon? <laughs> because that Clefairy probably would have tried to use Attract or something. Oh man, thank. Luckily it wasn't like a really good move. <laughs> but still, that's still kind of scary that it just used Nasty Plot to raise its special attack from the Metronome. I wasn't expecting Metronome to be as helpful like that. I think my frame rates are, are dropping. I don't know, it just seemed like the frame rates were dropping. Or maybe I'm just tripping, I don't know. Uh, yeah, we want to switch. Oh, man. Actually, I want to see, I want to see if Checkmate can do enough damage with the Steel type move. I probably should have healed up Checkmate more, just so we could tank more damage. It's probably going to be like the worst decision I decided to do. Oh, sh snap! That did a lot. Better not be a fire fighting ground move. But it's a oh, that's going to do a lot still. Oh, we did it. Woo! But that was a crit? Wow. Okay, checkmate. I see you out here. You really want your spot on the team. You earned it. Unlike Shimmy Sham. Yeah, now I really can't wait to get a bishop on the team. Bisharp. Uh, let's heal up. 
might have to use more of those uh, EXP candies to try to bring the team up. Okay, wow, a, a Silicobra is what we ended up getting. Sand sp oh yeah, when... I think either when their health drops to a certain amount, like they start the sandstorm, or it's just once they start their turn, the sandstorm can kick in. Is that a critical? Wow. Yeah, that was a critical capture right there. Uh, we are going to call you Silicobra. We want to call you. I don't know. Uh, I don't know what to call you. <laughs> We're gonna call you Jiro. I don't know, guys. I, I just didn't know what to call this guy. But guys, I hope you enjoyed uh, the episode. Make sure you leave a like for the video. It helps out the video a lot. And also subscribe to my channel. It helps out the channel a lot. And if you're already subscribed, hit that notification bell. So you stay notified when these videos are uploaded. But with that said, guys, stay sharp. Later.